So pork is one of the chapters in the book. Uh, pork is a fantastically good value meat uh, and very popular around the country. So this is a beautiful half shoulder of pork, around about four, four and a half kilos. Uh, next time you're going to do a nice big family roast, this is the one to go for. This is the best roast pork, in my opinion. Uh, not only is it cheaper, but it's my favourite cut. It's delicious. You can slow cook it. The meat's really, really juicy. I've got a few little tips to make this taste incredible. Firstly, go and get a Stanley knife. Really, really good. Have a look at the natural fat in the pig. You can see how deep it is. And then you can set your Stanley knife to exactly that thickness. And then you just score away and go all the way around the skin. And then once you've scored it all over, we're going to make a beautiful flavoured salt. Now, flavoured salt is dead simple. In a liquidizer or a pestle and mortar, pork's best friend are these little babies. Fennel seeds. Really fresh, really nice, with a good pinch of salt and a good pinch of pepper. Maybe a tiny, tiny bit of chilli, dry chilli. Uh, you can grind those up. Absolutely smells fantastic. If you want to put some fresh herbs in as well, rosemary, thyme, bay leaf particularly is very, very good. And we've basically made a flavoured salt. So just get a whole load of that and then sprinkle it from a height over your pork. It's going to kind of fall off as well. I'm just going to add a tiny bit of olive oil just to make it stick. And then we get into sort of massage action. And this is fantastic for any party any family roast, and of course, the whole thing about Save With Jamie is not just having the celebration of a beautiful lunch, it's like, what are we gonna do with the leftovers? And I've got some incredible recipes, like so many recipes that you can do with this, you're gonna absolutely love it. So rub that fennel seed all over the pork, salty, fennelly, and I'm gonna put this in an oven at full whack, right? Um, so what's gonna happen is the crackling starts to crackle, and then uh, after about 40 minutes, 45 minutes, turn it right down to 130 degrees Celsius and then leave it for four, four and a half, five hours. And you know when it's perfect because you just go into that meat here and you pull it and it just pulls away and it's tender and delicious and juicy and the leftovers are beyond. And of course, when you go to cook the leftovers, you're not just doing a five minute or a 10 minute or a 15 minute meal because you've actually got the flavour and texture of something that's had five hours cooking. So it's really, really good, really, really clever. And it's just about being smart with the leftovers and the shopping. So there you go, guys. That's going in the oven. I hope you enjoy the book. Lots of love.